The San Sebastian Street Festival is officially in the books. This weekend full of fun and festivities, and it all started with the cutting of the ribbon by the mayor of San Juan. Francis Felix takes a look back at the celebration. With the bomba rhythm and the traditional ribbon cutting, the San Sebastian Street Festival, Las Fiestas de la Calle San Sebastian, officially begins. More than half a million visitors are expected to attend the event during this whole weekend here at Old San Juan. With our authentic rhythm of La Bomba y Plena by the group El Junte Lo Iseño and the traditional ribbon cutting, this made a way for the 54th celebration of the San Sebastian. Thousands of locals and tourists gathered since early hours in a busy celebration to be part of the first day of the capital's festivities. Major Miguel Romero assures us that the event is an opportunity to demonstrate that the best Christmases are celebrated on the island. And we are very pleased that the people, you know, is, are enjoying the festivities. So we're expecting the next four days to be the same, the same experience that we just uh, had. And this is tremendous. These are the longest and best Christmas seasons of the world are here in San Juan, Puerto Rico. So. I expect nothing less. This year, the festival was dedicated to La Vedette de America, Iris Chacon, Chef Ivan Clemente from Kennedy's Lunchroom, and former basketball player Jose Piculin Ortiz, who received the distinction on stage in front of the public. Uh, very proud and uh, very thankful for, for the recognition. And uh, these are the greatest, uh, you know, party. Uh, of Calle San Sebastián in Puerto Rico, which is uh, the best in, in, in America. So it's been a pleasure. Very happy and honored to be part of this uh, great tradition, the Fiesta de San Sebastián. I love it, I love it. And to also be with, um, sharing this recognition with Jose Piculín, that it's an important figure in sports in, in the island also. This is, this is fantastic and the chef, uh, Clemente is with us today and I'm very happy with the uh, Alcalde and everybody. Everything is very, very good. In addition okay. at the ceremony, the Rafaela Valladares okay. Culture Awards were presented to the Cesar Concepcion Foundation, the Feliza Rincón de Gaudier Foundation, and Gary Núñez, director and founder of the Plena Libre Group. The festivity which revives the legacy of Doña Rafaela Valladares will extend until Sunday with musical, gastronomic and artistic offerings. Reporting from Olsen Juan Puerto Rico, Frances Felix. Puerto Rico!